Well, how long do you think it's been? Oh, a couple of weeks, maybe. A little more. Darren, it's been six months. No, it can't be. Yes, it has been. Six months, no sex. I know how good your memory is, but that doesn't sound right. Well, trust me, it is right. And we really need to do something about it. Like what? Like, take a vacation. You know, we can do a quick little weekend getaway. It'll be fun. A little bubbly. <laughs> we could, but I don't think I have that kind of time right now. Neither do you. Well, I don't care. I'm willing to make the time. Since when? Every time I try to start something, you're too busy studying. OK, well, every time I try to start something, you're always busy working. And you know, when we got married, we promised ourselves that we would never let it get boring in the bedroom. Do you remember that? I remember. So how is it that we managed to let six whole months go by and we barely even noticed? Six months and nine days, actually. You know, I hate that you're keeping track of how often we have sex. Well, actually, it's more like I'm keeping track of how often we're not. Well, what do you think? Hmm, it's okay. Yeah, I thought it'd be a little bigger, though. So no getaway? Uh, not even a weekend? I want to, April. I just don't see it happening right now. Great. Saying no to vacation sex. We're officially old. <laughs> Hey, guys. Hi, Robin. Hey. hey, how are you? Good, how you doing? Good, I really think you guys are gonna like this one. Come on, let's go see it. So this is it. Ah. This property just went on the market. It's three bedrooms, two and a half baths. It's got a formal dining room, as you can see. And April, you are not going to believe the closet space. Hmm. Oh, no. You hate it. No, I don't hate it. I really don't. <sighs> you know, I just don't think that this is the one. Are you sure you don't want to take a quick look upstairs first? Yeah, I'm sure. What do you think? To be honest, I kind of like it. But you know, we both have to be happy. I'm sorry. I know this is like the millionth house you've shown us and... It's OK. We'll see a million more if we have to. All right. All right. Houses are like people. They always have some kind of imperfection. There's no such thing as a perfect house. There's a perfect house for us. It is out there. All we have to do is find it. <laughs> Trouble. Hey. What are you doing right now? Uh, nothing. Well, I'm in the car driving with Derek. We're going home. Good. Come and have a drink with us. We're at Rosie's. Um... Hi, Derek. Hi, Christy. I can't. I've got homework. Come on. One drink's not going to kill you. Derek, bring your wife to me right now. <laughs> wow. <laughs> One drink. That's it. OK, and so you guys had sex on the motorcycle? Yes, talk that. I'm sorry, April. I'm, I've heard this story before, <laughs> and I can confirm it isn't the case. Yes, thanks, sweetie. OK, but wait, I, I don't get it. Like, how would he be able to steer and have sex with you at the same time? Yeah. No, we weren't moving. We were apart. Apart? Well, that doesn't count. Why? It was sex. It was on a motorcycle. If the motorcycle wasn't moving, then it's not that impressive. Not impressive? Are you kidding me? Do you know how much balance and flexibility it takes? Oh, no. There's only a lot of balance and flexibility. <laughs> hey, back me up on this. What? No, I'm sorry, honey. I'm going to have to go with Derek on this one. Oh, no, you suck. You're not my best friend anymore. <laughs> I am, too, your best friend. OK, let's just think of it this way. What if I said that I did it in the car, but the car was parked in a garage? 
How could I call that a big deal? Right, but if the car was flying down the 405 freeway, mm -hmm. then you got bragging rights. Give me some. Ah. That's not a bad idea. But it's always Try jammed. Really? <laughs> All right, guys. Hi. Sorry, your server had to run home and handle an emergency, so I will be taking care of you the rest of the night. I'm Jessica. Hi. Jessica. You must be new here. Kind of. Oh, sort of. I used to work here a couple years ago. Then I left. Now I'm back. Great. Welcome back. Thanks. So can I get anybody anything? Um, you know, actually, wow, we, we should be going. Yeah, it's about that time. No, yeah. oh. yeah. no, 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 no. Stay Seriously? for yeah. one more. I Come can't. On. Come on, I gotta hit the books. All right. Mm. So what do you think? You wanna head out or? Um, no, I'm cool. Sticking around. Yeah, okay. okay. <laughs> All right, well then I guess we'll talk to you guys later. Okay. That's for, no, 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 that's for you. Oh, you cheated. Uh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Hey, Look, and girl. the first round is on me, guys. Aw, thanks. Uh, I appreciate that. Man. Thank you. All right, I'll thank you. you. I hate See you, ladies. Bye. Right. Uh, thanks. Yeah, that wasn't funny. <laughs> <laughs> so, you guys good here? Do you need uh, anything else? Yes, we have. Red. We red. Can you top sex on a motorcycle? doing? I am trying to distract you. Uh, uh huh. Yeah, I, I can feel that. <laughs> no, 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 no. Come on, stop it. I, I have got a ton of stuff I've got to get into my head by the end of the week. And you also have a six month and nine day dry spell to break. Mm. Okay. It, right after I'm done with this, I promise I will be in. I'll be in with you. <sighs> All right, all right, all right. 20 minutes, okay? You better make them count. That's all I need. Mm. Ah, come here, you. <laughs> Hi. Give me a big kiss. Mm. Mm. I'm so happy. We got some time. Mm. Oh. No, no, no. Don't, don't even think about it. But I have to, it's probably work. <laughs> I know. <laughs> mm -hmm. And you can call them back after you have sex with your wife. Mm -hmm. <gasps> no, Derek, come on. Derek, come, on. Uh, come on, seriously, would hello? you? Hello? Why, what happened? No, I'm not coming in. It's my day off. That's not a lot of people. You've cooked for larger parties than that. I don't care that they requested me. I can't just, just... <sighs> Okay, fine. I'm on my way. <sighs> don't be bad. I won't be long. <laughs> you will. I'll be there all night. It's no big deal, right? April, I'm doing this for us. You know I wouldn't be able to afford to buy the house if the restaurant wasn't doing so well. <laughs> oh, okay, so, so you're buying the house by yourself now? Is that what's happening? <laughs> you know, it's fine, just, just go. <clears throat> I promise I won't be long, okay? I promise. Shut up. I'm horny and I need coffee. <sighs> Come on. Good morning. So, the cold streak continues. Mm, unfortunately. I have no idea what I'm going to do. I even floated the idea of us taking a quick vacation, but he shot me down. Mm hmm. 
Oh, you know what? <laughs> Let's just talk about something else. This is way too depressing. What's too depressing? April needs more dick in her life. Really? Mm -hmm. Still? I know. I know. Oh, it's like forever. It's been like uh, okay. Months, hello, uh, right here. Uh, hey, friend over here, dying inside, wounded. So you, could you maybe not talk about me? Like, I'm not. Oh, hi. Um, sorry. It's okay. <clears throat> uh, April, you probably remember Jessica. Yeah, you're the waitress. <clears throat> yeah. Hi. Hi. Do you mind if we get going? Not at all. Ladies, if you'll excuse us, I have to give Jessica here a drive back to her car. Oh, yeah, sure. Mm hmm <laughs> OK, drive safe. Yeah. All right. Bye. Bye. Uh, it was nice to see you again. Yeah, uh, you too. What is wrong with you? Why did you tell me that you guys had somebody over? I wouldn't have just invited myself in the way I did. It's OK. You didn't interrupt anything. <sighs> Go ahead. You know you want to look. You know I do. <laughs> oh, man. You guys work fast. <laughs> you just met the poor girl last night. Oh, what can I say? You and Derek left, and the three of us sort of hit it off. Oh, yeah. Right. All right, what's going on with you? Come on. I don't know. I know we still love each other, and we're still hot for each other. It's just like we're too busy to enjoy each other. And it wasn't always like this. I mean, we used to do it all the time. But at some point, I don't know, the sex just kind of tapered off, and I didn't even realize it was happening. Sorry, ladies. Don't mind me. That was fast. Jessica forgot her phone. Ah, the leave behind. Classic rookie move means she liked us. Got it. See you later. Bye. Bye. What are you thinking? Nothing. <laughs> I just had a crazy thought. Can I ask you a personal question? Of course you can. No, like a really personal question. You okay? Remember when we went to Miami? <sighs> yeah, what about it? We were on that red-eye flight, and at some point, you realized that everybody else had fallen asleep. And so you dared me. Oh, no, no, you double dared me to sneak into the bathroom with you. <laughs> <laughs> and so I did. Yeah, that was fun. Mm-hmm. I never do stuff like that anymore. Are you saying you want to have sex on a plane again? No. Maybe not that. But I think we should do something, you know, something different. Different like what? Matt and Christy had a girl over last night. <laughs> Matt and Christy always have a girl over. Sometimes a girl and a guy. <laughs> yeah, I know. So I had a thought. And what if we did something like that? What are you saying? You want to have an open marriage? No. <laughs> I was just thinking we could try a one-time thing, you know, just to get our group back. <laughs> All right. 
What is this, a test? You're not saying that you'd let me have sex with Christy. It's not a test, and trust me, it's not like I would love it, but I don't know, I'd be there too, and it wouldn't be like you were going behind my back. Well, I mean, if you're serious, I, uh, okay, I, I'm down. Yeah? Okay, good. Um, we'll figure out what's a good night for them, and I'll set it up. Whoa, 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 them? Yeah. The four of us, that's what we've been talking about here, That's Derek. not what I'm talking about. What makes you think I want to share our bed with a man? That's not what I was thinking. Why are you getting so uncomfortable? Because I'm comfortable with three, not four. So you're fine with having sex with me and another woman? But the minute I want to throw another man into the mix, that's the deal breaker. Don't ask me to explain it, but that's, it's different. Um, yeah, you know, I can explain it. It's called a double standard. You know, Derek, we don't even have to try this. It was just an idea. <laughs> but if you think I'm not going to call you out for your bullshit, you're crazy. Okay, I'll do it. But I don't want him touching me. I don't want him on my side of the bed. I don't want the lights on. I don't even want to know he's in the room. And if that makes me crazy and uptight, then that's just what I'll be. Okay, you're not crazy or uptight. <laughs> Look, all we have to do is set the ground rules and nobody will have a problem. Up. Not long. Are you okay? Yeah, fine. Sounds like they're back in business. Mm -hmm. Looks like our job here is done.
What time is your interview? Uh, a couple hours. I'm heading out soon. All right. I gotta go. Good luck. <laughs> Thanks. Hey, so I just want to say uh, I had fun last night. <laughs> yeah, me too. Yeah. If you want to, you know, see Derek again, just let me know. I'll, I'll clear out. Um, we're not seeing either of them again. Remember, not like last night. That was just a favor. What do you mean? You know we're not supposed to mess around with friends. Friends get weird, things get complicated. Okay. Right. Jesus. Was she that good? Should I be worried? She was okay. But she sure as hell wasn't you. Uh-huh. All right. That's more like it. You want to know how Derek was? Tell you everything. Not the least bit curious. Hmm. Jeez. Ah, I already knew that. Okay. Call me and let me know how it goes. Okay, I will. I'll mail these while I'm out. Ooh, actually, uh, you can't. Uh, sorry, I thought we had enough to cover the checks I wrote, but we don't, so... They'll have to wait until we get some money in. You pay it on Friday? Friday, then. I hope you get this job. Don't worry. I'll make them love me. I know you will. <laughs> Did I tell you how amazing you were last night? Nope. Well, you were... <sighs> Amazing last night. Thanks. You're kind of quiet this morning. Are you all right? Yep. Okay. Hey, you know what would be great? If you use two words to answer me instead of just one. I'm just wondering why it was so important for you to do this. What do you mean? You know why. We talked about it. I know, but, uh... You know what? Forget it. All right, Derek, don't do that. You know I hate it when you do that. Just tell me what's on your mind. You let him go down on you. So? So I thought that was off limits. What made you think that? You never let me do it. Don't let you. Excuse me, but you choose not to do it, and I choose not to complain about it. Yeah. You don't complain about it. You just get me to let somebody else come in here and do it for you. What? Hold up. What are you saying? Are you saying that I tricked you into this? I don't know. Did you? <laughs> All right, you know what, can we, can, we just, can we just start this whole conversation over? We don't have to, just forget I said anything. What was I supposed to do? I mean, look, it, it's not like I planned it. Oh my God. He just sort of, I, he just went for it and I just, was I supposed to tell him to stop? Like I said, we don't need to talk about this. Derek, why? How? I don't even understand how you could be jealous right now. It is not like I cheated on you. You were right there. Really? Yeah, really. What? This is crazy. Mm -hmm. I thought we were finally good. We just had sex in the fucking bathroom. I didn't initiate that. What? <laughs> like I said, I didn't start the bathroom thing. Oh. You came in there while I'm taking a shower and jumped all over me. 
It is what it is. Right, apparently it is. Okay, I got you. I got you. Okay. All right, so, so, so when you have a problem with me, you can fuck me, right? But you can't talk to me? It's a perk. Well, I'm glad that I'm still good for something around here. Me too. <laughs> She got called into work. Shit. What's wrong? It's nothing. Um, I'm sorry I bothered you. You guys had a fight, didn't you? About last night. How'd you know? That look on your face. I've seen it before. You wanna, you wanna talk about it? <sighs> Only if you're not busy. Because I really need to get out of here for a little while. My day's wide open. So, what happened? He got mad because... <laughs> because... <laughs> what? <laughs> so funny. Oh, it's nothing. You know, I'm sorry, I, I don't think I could talk to you about this. I, I thought I could, but now that I'm actually sitting here, I don't think that I can. Wow. Okay. If you don't want to talk about it, we don't have to talk about it. You shouldn't feel awkward with me. I mean, I know, I know, but we're still friends. Yeah, we're friends that slept together. <laughs> oh, no. yeah. And we're married. I know, I know. Ugh, God, this is so strange. And I thought this was supposed to be every man's fantasy, right? I mean, come on. And then now he's trying to act like he's some sort of victim? Is that why you did it? Just, just for him? No, I, I did it for me too. Yeah? I did. A little bit? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I did that. I don't know, I thought it'd just kind of bring the magic back. But instead, it's just blowing up in my face. Hmm. So, how do you and Christy do it? Uh, do what? Well, um, I get behind her. She does her taxes, and I, <laughs> and I just take her, and then she's like, ten ninety nine, and she finishes. Them. Right. Yeah, we always right. do taxes. Mm, that's straight. amazing. I know. It's good it's and efficient. efficient. <laughs> ah. <laughs> I've got good lotion here. Okay. okay, so I think I figured out what started your fight with Derek. Hmm. Mm -hmm. So is that what you've been thinking about all this time? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So we're gonna do this. All right, fine. Yeah. D or d tell me your little theory. <laughs> sex, you don't always, you know, finish, or he finishes before you, but, you know, hey, me, oh. <laughs> you made it all the way there, and I think, uh, think 
he found that kind of threatening. <laughs> nice try. <laughs> You're not even close. Come on, you can be honest with me. Well, I am being honest. Trust me, Derek is good in that department. How good? Better than me? <laughs> Matt, what are you doing? Ah, uh, I'm asking you a question. No, you're flirting with me. Yeah. I... I like flirting with you. Stop it. I mean it. Okay. I, uh, okay. I'm sorry. Look, I'm trying to fix something here, not make it worse, you know? Yeah. And if you can't help me or just listen to me vent, well then, you know, we should just probably just go. April, wait. Uh, okay, I... <sighs> You're right. I just thought that you and I had uh, a really strong connection last night. A lot stronger than I thought it was going to be. But if I misread the situation, okay, I, you know, just say the word, I'll back off. We had sex. We didn't connect. You know, I, I'm not one of these girls that you and and Christy take home and... Oh, come on. Yeah, okay, you know what? Mm, whatever. That's, yeah. This was stupid. <laughs> we should just go. Okay. Yeah. for picking up a check. And don't worry, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll pay you back. Money's just, you know, it's been a little tight lately. Hi, Robin. Oh, wow. I'd like to, I just, I don't know if we can make it. Um, yeah, see, Derek is probably, you no, know, he's at work now, and um, I'm, uh, you know, actually, yes. Uh, we'll make it, I'm, I'll get him there. So what time are you thinking? Oh, okay, cool, yeah, um, well, let me give you a call back. Okay, bye. I got it, Kevin. Thanks. This is ready to go. Okay. Hey. Um, do you get a break soon? I have an hour coming up. Why? Robin called. She wants us to take a look at another place. Okay. 
Can you hang out for a few? I'll be here. All right. Now, I'll be honest, this one is at the upper end of your price range, but I still really wanted you to see it. It has that fantastic gourmet kitchen, all the cabinets are brand new, and the master bedroom suite opens up onto a beautiful covered patio. Mm. Are they flexible on price? Well, I know the other agent, so there's definitely wiggle room. It's nice, don't you think? Yeah. Big backyard we could put in a pool. Yeah. And there's only three registered sex offenders in this neighborhood. Yeah. Yeah. I think we're gonna pass on this one. Yeah. I'm getting that feeling too. What? Registered sex offender? I was teasing you. It didn't seem like you were paying too much attention back there. I was paying attention. I just don't think that that's our house. What was wrong with it? Is it too big? Is it too small? Not enough bedrooms? What? I don't know. I can't put my finger on it. I just know that the moment we walk into the house that's meant for us, I'll know. We both will. Well, I guess we'll keep looking then. OK, you know that I'm so mad at you, right? I know. And I apologize. I should have never said those things to you. I just got freaked out last night. I, I thought I, I would be able to handle what happened. And but seeing it for myself, I look, whatever. It was my fault, not yours. And I just need to get past it. Right, you don't ever get to talk to me the way you did. Ever again. I won't. I won't, I promise. offered me a full-time teaching position starting Monday. Are you serious? Yeah, I, I mean, there's a little bit of paperwork, but as of next week, I am officially part of the faculty and not just a substitute. That's amazing. Oh my god. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank wow. you. Wow, good work. So, how did your thing go? What thing? Your interview, silly. I was expecting a call or a text or something. Oh, that, yeah. They they called and pushed it back to tomorrow. No, oh, I'm sorry. Well, that just means you have another day to prepare, right? That's right. So, uh, what have you been doing all day? Nothing. Uh, just hanging out. You haven't even left the house? Uh... No. OK. Come on. You're getting dressed. What for? We're going to go celebrate. OK. Sweet. <laughs> well, to my girl, Christy, the best teacher ever. Yes, I don't know about all that. I just hope I don't warp their little brains too badly. <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> mm. Okay, where's Derek? He said he'd come right back and hang out. Uh, well, you know, it's the top of a shift, so he's got to slice and dice and make it all fabulous. Mm, but I wanted us to have a little... Oh, 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 oh okay. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah. I'm really happy about that. <laughs> yes, I am. All right, okay, I have to now go take my clothes off. Oh, wow. All right. <laughs> Do you... Okay.
You're not still mad at me, are you? Yeah, that depends. Are you gonna hit on me again? <laughs> no. But, for the record, I... I, I do think you kind of overreacted. <laughs> wow. Well, you know, for the record, you did kind of go way over the line. Okay. Guess we'll just agree to disagree then. You know, I actually have a better idea. How about we agree that you were wrong? Okay. Fine. I was wrong. Dinner's on us, by the way. You don't have to do that. And Derek hates it when his friends pay. Yeah. But uh, that was before I slept with his wife. Why don't you say that a little louder? I don't think everybody heard you. I'm sorry, was I over the line again? Wait. Hold on. Um, try to the right. No, no, no. My right. Could you just... Okay. All right. Uh, let's just stop. <laughs> What's wrong? Nothing. You know, I just... Come up here. Oh. Oh. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I just wanted you next to me. Oh, I get it. You're trying to tell me I don't know what I'm doing. No, I didn't say that. You didn't have to. What are you doing? Okay. Let's try it again. What for? I obviously don't know what I'm doing. Not like Matt. Will you talk to me, please? <sighs> you all set? Yeah. I think so. Hey, how come they pushed your interview from yesterday to today. Oh, um, the guy had a conflict. Uh, I think it was a family emergency or something. Oh, so they called and asked you to come in today instead? Yeah. They called you? Christy, yes. Why do you ask? No reason. They called again when you were in the shower. You're confirmed for this afternoon. Okay. Good. Thanks. Mm-hmm. Good luck. Thank you. <laughs> I 
then he just walked out. And I tried to get him to talk to me, but he just left without saying anything. Now, he knows how much I hate it when he does that. You know, I think he did it on purpose. And you're not even listening to me, so... Hey. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What? I am. I am. No, you're not. <laughs> you're off on another planet somewhere. All right. That's up. What's going on with you? <sighs> Something's going on with Matt. He had this big job interview yesterday, one he was really excited about. But I think he ended up blowing it off. Well, what makes you think that? Because the company called this morning. He was in the shower, so I answered his phone. They wanted to confirm that he was coming in today, since he called them yesterday and asked them to push it back, except he'd already lied to me and said they pushed it back. Okay, so wait, so he had plans yesterday? Yeah, but apparently he ended up doing something else. I just don't know what. Christy, I... Oh, my God. I'm so stupid. I bet it was Jessica. Who? Jessica, that goddamned waitress. Oh. Well... That's just perfect. We're barely able to pay our bills, and he's skipping job interviews so he can chase some girl behind my back? I'm gonna kill him. <sighs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to dump all that on you. <laughs> no, it's okay. that for dinner last night I know you prefer to treat but <laughs> here just just take it don't worry about it I'm not worried about it I just I'd rather pay my own way since when you guys have been eating at my restaurant ever since I started working there I've never seen you stressed out about picking up a bill before nobody's stressed out I just I don't need your charity Derek Last I heard, you still didn't have a job. So the way I see it, you do need my charity. All right. Yeah, you're right. I guess you're right. I didn't need your help. The way you needed mine. What's that supposed to mean? Well, somebody had to teach you how to satisfy April. <laughs> and come to think of it, you never did thank me for that, so maybe we'll just call it. Shut the fuck up. Oh, uh, she told me you were jealous. She fucking told me. And I don't blame you. It was probably the best fucking sex she had. Oh, keep, uh, keep talking. Uh, keep talking. You regret it, Derek? Letting another man fuck your wife. Uh, 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 bitch. So frustrating. I've been trying to get him to tell me what happened, but all he keeps saying is he doesn't want to talk about it. Uh, yeah, you know, I got home right after it happened. But from what I heard, it sounds like they were just being idiots. And then, well, it got a little out of control. All right, so what do we do? We get them to sit down together and iron it out? Because if that doesn't work, I am willing to knock some sense into both of them. <laughs> okay, easy. I don't think we have to go that far. You know, I just hate that this craziness made Matt miss his interview again. He didn't go? Didn't he tell you? He hasn't told me anything. God, I just assumed. All right, I gotta go. You know, Christy, wait, just...
You know, you could have at least told me you missed your interview. I don't know if you noticed, but I kind of got my ass kicked today. I couldn't exactly go in there spitting up blood. Did they let you reschedule? Oh, man. Uh, I totally didn't call them back. I forgot. Matt, what is going on with you? Do you even want this job? Of course I do. Then maybe you can explain to me why these things keep happening. What, what things are you talking about? You lied to me about why you didn't go to the interview, and then today you just happen to get into a fight while you're on Wait the way minute. to the interview. I never lied to you. Yes, you did. I talked to them when you were in the shower. They told me you canceled on them. That isn't what you told me. Okay, so I got the details mixed up. What, what difference does it make? The difference is that I am not a fool. Matt, I know what you've been up to. Christy. Don't. If you want to keep seeing Jessica, then just be honest about it. You don't have to sneak around worrying about keeping your story straight. Matt, I get it. I do. Jessica's hot and she was fun to fool around with and... <sighs> you just can't let her interfere with you finding a job because we are really hanging by a thread here. I know we are. But I... I haven't seen Jessica since we saw Jessica. I haven't even talked to her. So, you can stop worrying about that. Are you sure? Because this has been driving me crazy. I'm positive. You're wearing yourself sick over nothing. Maybe I am. I have been stressing a lot lately. It doesn't help that Derek and April are buying a house and starting this great new life together and we're sitting here stuck in the mud. I know. But it'll be our turn soon. <sighs> Better be. Mm -hmm. I tried calling you a few times. I know. Look, I know I went a little overboard earlier, yeah, but... You don't have to apologize to me. Matt's downstairs. I'm not talking about Matt. I don't care about Matt. I'm talking about you and I. Us trying to be like them was stupid. We should have never tried to be like Matt and Christy. We're not them and we never will I be. I wasn't trying to be like anybody. I was trying to get closer to you. You... you don't regret it? Why should I? April, you... you slept with another man. And where were you when that was happening? Oh, yeah. You were right next to me sleeping with another woman. Yeah. And I'm ashamed of it. Well, you shouldn't be, Derek. You shouldn't be ashamed of anything that we did that night. If there's anything you should be ashamed about is the way you've been acting ever since. Hi. Hey, April. I came by to say I'm sorry for outing you. You outed me? Last night, on the phone with Christy, I said something about you not making it to your interview. I, I had no idea that she didn't already know. Don't worry about that. We, we worked it all out. Yeah? Yeah. Are you sure? I'm... I'm positive. So, um, 
How you feeling today, champ? <laughs> Don't you start. <laughs> I bruise easily. I know. <laughs> I'm I'm fine. Thanks. Good. I uh I could use some air though. So you're saying you're not a perfectionist. Oh wow. So you're just taking his side. No, uh, no, no, no. It's that's, a house. Hey, I know your bromance, so it's all good. Great. <laughs> hmm. So I have a question. Okay. <laughs> Why didn't you just call me? I mean this morning. Something as simple as a quick apology, normally you just pick up the phone for that. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to make sure that you were okay. Oh. Yeah, because you know men have a tendency to want to pretend that they're not hurt. And, well, I knew that you couldn't do it if I if I was looking at you. Yeah. So. So you were you were worried about me. Yeah. Is he okay? <laughs> I'm about to hit you. <laughs> no, the whole family. Oh. All right, yes, I admit it. I was a little bit worried. <laughs> the other day you said that um, you weren't busy. That wasn't true. <sighs> no, no, it wasn't. I had an interview, but I, uh, I moved it at the last minute. Matt, you haven't worked in like eight months, and then this big opportunity comes by, and you just blow it off? How come? Because you knocked on my door. All right, come on. I'm trying to be serious here. So am I. I wanted to spend some time with you alone. So that's what I did. That's what I do. Don't you think that was a little irresponsible? It was totally irresponsible. So then why did you do it? Come on, because we connected the other night? Yes. Because of that. And because... I haven't been able to get you out of my head ever since. I'm married, Matt. So are you. I know. You know, even though Derek is pissing me off right now, I still love him. I know that too. Good. Because I would never do anything to hurt him. Or Christy. Well... What if Christy was okay with it? Okay with what? Uh, with me joining your little harem? <sighs> is that where you think this is going? Uh... Right. You know what, I actually need to get back to studying, so we should just go. Just for the record, I don't actually have a harem. <laughs> I know you don't. All right. That was mean and judgmental. 
sorry. No, don't be sorry, please. I, I love finding out what you really think of us. Okay, stop it mm -hmm. with the drama, okay? I that is so. not what I think. Okay, then. Let's have it. Have what? What you do think. Whatever you imagine goes on with us. All right, you know I love you guys, right? Mm. Oh, boy. <laughs> Where's this going? Okay. Well, I could never tell Christy this because I didn't think it was my place, but I just kind of always felt like the whole open marriage thing was just sort of bullshit. How so? It's basically legalized cheating. Uh. <laughs> What? I mean, come on, am I wrong? I know it might look that way from the outside, I get it, but... Yes, you're wrong. I don't cheat on Christy, on my wife. Okay, how do you not cheat when you're sleeping with other people? Was it cheating when you and Derek slept with us? Well, no. Okay, but, whoa, that's different because mm -hmm. we talked about it beforehand and we mm -hmm. made an agreement. Exactly. Christy and I made one, too. So what's the difference between agreeing for one night versus an entire relationship? Thanks for checking up on me. You're welcome. And, uh, you know, I'm sorry that I snapped at you. Oh, don't worry about it. I, I deserved it. Yeah, you did. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why do I ever admit fault? <laughs> <laughs> but either way, I shouldn't have done it. Okay, I'll accept your apology if you accept mine. Hmm. Deal. Mm. Still friends? Always. Okay. I was just gonna go downstairs and, and talk to Christy about something. Well, I think I just saved you a, a trip. Hey, told you I was gonna do it. Do what? Stage an intervention. <sighs> you should have seen him downstairs moping around like he lost his best friend. I saw Derek pulling up outside and I thought, all right, you guys are going to sit down and work this out. Yeah. So, here we are. Yeah. All right. Let's do this. And I, uh, <laughs> I realized I was way out of line for all the things I said. I was wrong. And, uh, so I wanted to, I 
and say I'm sorry. I was wrong too. About a lot of things. See how easy that was? And it only took like 10 seconds. I mean, unless you've got something you want to apologize for too. What? I'm just saying, since we're on a roll here, if you've got something you want to confess, now's the time. <laughs> uh, no. I'm good. Perfect. Because I need a drink. <sighs> hmm. Yeah, me too. Pick your poison. Mm. <laughs> oh, great. It's Robin. <laughs> oh, here, I'll talk with her. Hey, Robin. Yeah, no, no, no. Sorry, it's just been a crazy day. Ah. What? Mm. Right now, really? Um, she wants to show us a place. Not now. Mm-hmm. Sure, sure. She says she thinks that we'll love it, but we've got to see it today. The listing's going out in the morning. All right. Text us the address. Yep. All right. See you soon. Thanks. Bye. You guys want to come along? Uh, Derek, they're probably tired. Oh, come on. It's five minutes in and out. Yeah. All right. Come on in, guys. Wow. <laughs> it's beautiful, isn't it? It's uh, just under 2,000 square feet. It's... I, I want to hear about this one. OK. It's uh, four bedrooms, two and a half baths. Um, it's got an attached two-car garage, and the owners already replaced the roof. Mm. God, I love the windows. So what do you think? It's uh, nice. What do you think? I think it feels like us. Mm. Us is in you and Derek. Me and Derek are the only us that I'm a part of, Matt. And what happened today didn't happen. Yes, it did. Not if I say it didn't. Yeah, look, and we are not going to talk about this here. We are not going to talk about this anywhere. Ever again. Look, I'm not going to... Uh... April! I'm in here. Well, what do you think? I, uh, I love it. Good. She says she thinks it's going to go fast, so if we want it, we need to jump. And I say, let's jump. Perfect. Robin did it. I mean, she did it. That was the one, absolutely. It's good, it's good, it's beautiful, it's roomy, spacious enough for us. Spacious, did you see the bathroom? With the Whirlpool jets and everything? I could just crawl inside that thing and take a nap. Well, anytime you want to come over and use it, just call me. Okay, I will. I'll take that as an open invitation. Okay, I hate to break this to you, but I think we just ended up with a permanent house guest. Yeah, I think we, I think we did. What's up? You okay? But the 
is something I should probably tell you. <laughs> mm. Mm. Four bedrooms. I know. <laughs> One to be a nursery. I know. Mm. <laughs> I, I, I should probably just get that. <laughs> no, 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 okay, I'll be right back. I promise I'll be right back. <laughs> Hey, are you fucking kidding me? I asked you, I asked if Matt had been with somebody else and you lied to me. You looked me right in the eye and lied. Okay, Christy, just, just calm down, okay? I, I don't know what you're talking about. A and I never lied to you. You did. You said Matt wasn't here with another girl the other day, but he was. He was with you. Christy, nothing happened between me and Matt. April, I know you kissed him. <sighs> okay, Christy, just listen, let me just explain, okay? That was, that happened sort of by accident. Really? Really, was it by accident that you've been hanging out with them ever since that night and keeping it a secret? Or was it an accident when you said my whole relationship was bullshit? He told me everything. <laughs> you didn't have to tell me how stupid I was for trying to help you. <laughs> that part I figured out for myself. Oh, wait, Christy, just... I don't know what to say, Derek. Just say what happened. The morning after we all... together... I went looking for Christy, but she wasn't home. So, um... <laughs> I was really upset because of all the things you had said to me. And, um, I just... I just needed somebody to talk to. I don't need you to go through all the details. Just get to the part where you fucked him. I didn't. It was just a kiss. Just one kiss. And why should I believe you? Because that's the truth. I don't think you know what the truth is, April. I don't think you care. You looked at me every day and kept your dirty little secrets and let me walk around here like a goddamn fool. No, no, no. It was not like that. I promise you, there weren't any dirty little secrets. God, nothing even happened until today. Is that when you had sex with him? Stop asking me that. I already told you I didn't sleep with him. I will stop asking when I believe the answer. The only time I slept with Matt was when you were there. Which sounds more and more crazy to me every time I hear myself say it out loud. But that's it. Okay, that's it. That's all you're gonna get from me because that's the truth. You asked me if, if I, um, if I regretted us hooking up with them. And I told you that I didn't. And I still don't. Because as stupid as it was, it was a decision that we made together. But I, I regret everything else. And I guess the only explanation I have is that I was wrong. I just want to know if you fucked him, that's all. But 
he wanted to. Yes. But I didn't. I would never, ever do anything like that to you. Well, now you can. Congratulations. You win. I win? What? Derek's gone. He just left and I don't think he's coming back. <laughs> but that's what you wanted, isn't it? I just wanted Christy to know the truth. Why? So we would get back to Derek. Matt, you had to know that it would. I guess you're right. I probably should have thought of that. Got a point, you know? Why did you tell me? Was it because you knew I would confront her? Oh my god. You were trying to break them up. far beyond fucked up. I can't even believe it. No. No, you are not. You are not going to leave. We're going to deal with this right now. I get it, Christy. I fucked up. Is that what you want me to say? I want you to get this through your head. April doesn't want you. She doesn't want us. And she doesn't want our lifestyle. She wants her husband. And if she didn't, you wouldn't have needed to sabotage their marriage. Are you in love with her? No. I thought I was. But I'm not. I knew it. I knew getting involved with friends was a mistake. I told you it would get complicated, but you made me feel like I was worried over nothing. I can't believe I fell for that shit. I'm really sorry. I don't know what else to say. You don't have to say anything, Matt. You've done enough damage.
Is he back? Did you try calling him? I called, I, I texted, I emailed. He won't talk to me. Are you and Matt breaking up? I wouldn't give him the satisfaction. He'll be paying for this for the rest of his miserable life. He'll beg for death by the time I'm done. <laughs> I am so sorry, Christy. I know you are. I don't mean it. I, I really hate myself right now. I tried calling you. A lot. <laughs> Where'd you sleep last night? All right, can you please say something to me so I know that I still exist to you? I'm looking for my phone charger. Have you seen it? So we're not even gonna try to work this out? There's nothing to work out. Derek, don't you, don't you think you're being a little melodramatic about this? I mean, it, it was just a kiss. It was just one little kiss. And I already admitted that I was wrong. I mean, what else do you want from me? I don't want anything from you. That's what you don't understand. There's nothing that you can say to make me trust you again. Well, we don't have that. I guess we don't have anything. I guess we don't. I just know that I'm uh, way past the point of worrying about who is at fault. Do you think it would help if I tried talking to him? No.
want you to stop being a dick. <sighs> Just leave me alone, Christy. Everybody's sorry, Derek. April's sorry, Matt's sorry, I'm sorry, and I didn't even do anything. Look, they cheated on us. That may mean nothing to you and your little world, but it means a lot to me. I'm not exactly thrilled about it either, but we're not talking about me. You and April, we have a strong relationship. You can get past this. Not if I don't want to. So you'd rather be all morally outraged than fix your marriage? Just because you're wearing that wedding ring doesn't give you the right to lecture me about marriage. My marriage was real. Not just for show like yours. Okay, this whole thing is as much your fault as it is April's. You went into it with both eyes open, and this is the stuff that can sometimes happen. Matt and I should have said no to you guys in the first place, but we didn't, so here we are. Yeah, here we are. Hi, Robin. Hi, I'm really sorry to drop in on you like this, but uh, I was in the neighborhood, so I figured I would drop this by. What is this? Your offer letter. Now, I don't mean to rush you guys, but um, I just want to hurry up and get it signed before anyone else can squeak by us. I'm sorry. <laughs> I should have called you. I, I just assumed that Derek would have. Oh, no, it's OK. Like I said, I was in the neighborhood. <laughs> uh, no, that's not what I mean. Derek and I, uh, Wow, this is embarrassing. Um, we're not buying the house. We're not buying any house. We're, we're not together anymore. Oh my God, I'm, I'm so sorry to hear that. Are, are you okay? I'm fine, <laughs> thank you. Well, look, I don't wanna interfere, but if there's anything I can do, please let me know. I will. And April, if it's any consolation, I, I know what you're going through. I've been exactly where you are, twice, in fact. Really? Two divorces under my belt. Now, the first one was a mistake right from the start, but the second time, I should have worked a lot harder to save that one. Funny thing is, I. Uh... The idea of refusing to throw in the towel wasn't even an option. I. You, you know, I, I'm, I'm sorry. I um. I have to go. Thank you so much. can't be back here. You promised me a house. Go home. We'll talk about it later. You said that if you kept working and if I stayed in school, that we would have a house of our own. Then we finally find one, and it's just sitting there. It's waiting for us. Look. Robin brought over the offer letter. All, all we have to do is sign this and the house is ours. April, if you brought this over here for me to sign. No, that is not why I came here. All right. April, April, what are you doing? Are you crazy? What? I love that house, Derek. I could grow old in that house, but if it doesn't include you, I don't want it. Derek, I made a mistake. A lot of mistakes. I I can admit that. But when you married me, you said that you would love me no matter what. Well, this, this is the no matter what part. 
And I wish, I wish I could change what happened. But I know that I can't. But I also know that I'm not leaving here without my husband. I, I'm not letting you go. And what if this doesn't work? What if we can't get past this, huh? We will. We have to. Because Derek, Derek, I don't want to have to keep setting things on fire. And you know I will. <laughs> Stay away from my stove. <laughs> We'll talk about it later. Go home. Now get out of here. And take this with you. Go home. Empty. Ooh, wow. <laughs> well, thank you guys so much for all your help. That's what we're here for. Hey, we got some beers if you guys want to hang. That's okay. We should get going. Let you guys dig through the mess. Mm. So sweet of you mm -hmm. to leave like this. I'm sweet. <laughs> mm. Thanks, ma'am. Okay. Okay. <sighs> Call me later. Probably. How it begins. Yeah, I was like, what's appropriate to wear? As a teacher. <laughs> I mean, I don't want them to feel. Yeah, don't like, don't know, corrupt one anyone. One of them, but I do want them to. Feel yeah, yeah, don't be so. <laughs> Oh. Hey. Hey, you must be my new neighbors. Yeah. Hi, I'm Matt. Nice to meet you. Same here, Jordan. All right. Hi, I'm Jordan. Christy, I'm Christy. <laughs> You're Jordan. I am Christy. <laughs> That's right. Yeah, that cleared up. Okay. Um, you need a hand with anything? No, you know I don't have that much, but thanks. Well, welcome. And uh, you know, I guess we'll we'll see you around. Definitely. All right. I was talking okay. to you. Okay. <laughs> Jordan. thinking about four bedrooms I'm thinking we actually have four bedrooms <laughs> I know one could be a nursery I know I love you I love you too Here you are. 